Right, so what I think we should do, get rid of the pirates when we can, and then colonize this planet, colonize this part of the galaxy. And oh man, it's just going so well. It's just going so well. Um, Toad asteroid. Oh really? In Yakari. Yeah, definitely we want to start expanding this way. We've nearly gone across the side of the galaxy that we're on. That's pretty good if you ask me. I don't know. What I don't like seeing is the fact that we've got untapped resources here. And our silly little construction ships ain't doing the job for us there. But on the whole, I'd say our empire's doing pretty good work. Right. Oh, we can unlock the fortress now. Fortresses are good, man. Fortresses are real good. I think we get them. I think we go for them. Massive, massive defense stations. Right, this science ship. We're only level one over here, unfortunately, so we're not going to be able to get any of these, sadly. Um, not really a lot of level one scientists can do, is there? In fact, we can't even auto them. Or can we? No, oh, apparently there's a special project we can do. Ah, we'll, we'll auto it. We'll auto it here. Right, we can build right now. We'll do it in Ogo. Another gunship battleship, I think. So we're, we're looking for this to be 12k. And then we'll make another fleet. And we should even be, we should be able to do that. We should be okay for that. Really. Right now, it's just a case of making our planets look lovely. And I'd say we're doing a pretty good, pretty good job of that on the whole. We'll get there. We'll get there with that planet. What we actually want to do is work on the spaceport over here. Because there's a lot to do. So we get our solar panel and our hydrodronics farm. We just want the synchronized defenses coming in now. And there they are. That's in fact all we had to build there. Not so bad at all. Intellectual. Well, I'm very glad for him. Very glad for him. So yeah, we'll get our fleet to 12k. And then we'll build another fleet. And we'll send them both into the pirate stronghold. And see what's up. I think that's better because then... I don't know, our galaxy's getting big. I think we need more than one fleet now. But there's no point in being less than about 12k because they're just going to get, you know... I don't know, they need to be strong enough to be able to defeat any fleet they may fight by themselves. Because there's no point in having two fleets if one of them gets wiped out before the other one can get in to help it, is what I'm trying to say there. But I don't think that's going to be a problem for us. How are this lot doing, by the way? It's been a while since we've looked at them. People of Bulb, how are you? Still in the Industrial Age? Okay. Um, I feel like we should be doing more more about them. That's our research System station. We want to be looking at this. Passive observation. Hmm. You know, I really... F <sighs> They're a bit like us. Maybe we should indoctrinate them and then technologically enlighten them. Hmm. We'll think about it. We'll think about it. Right there. Good stuff. Good stuff going over here. Oh, wow. Yeah, there's some decent stuff at this side of the galaxy, isn't there? Construction ships have done everything. We could think about setting down another frontier outpost over here. We were going to colonize this planet at some point in the future. So there's not really much point, is there? Hmm. 580. It's very good. A 10k fleet we now have. Doesn't need to be that much better, does it? Spaceport. So we'll get another... Let's get another artillery one. And we'll get another... That's just a cruiser. Oh, they've got cheaper. Oh, yeah. They, they were... Yeah, everything's got cheaper. That's good. That's very good. Okay, we'll have another G-Class battleship, I think. When we can get it. Which is going to be now. There it is. Okay, so that's another two in. Love to hear our system surveys getting completed. Let's have another look at our ship designers here. Because I'm not sure. In fact, we need to check this in a minute. These have upgraded. Yes, these have upgraded very nicely. But what I don't know if they've done. Sure, lads, sure. That that's just so map info. Uh, so star charts are seeing what's there. Map that's basically we can see their stuff. Map information now. Uh, yeah, what we what I wanted to do was have a look here at our um, defense platform because I think we have to upgrade it manually. Oh, do we not? Oh, okay, good. Oh, okay, good. 
very nice. I don't think anyone's ever going to invade us. I think our massive fleet has acted as the deterrent that we needed it to. Alright, Yakri looking good as well. Hmm. Right, so 10k there. I think we just need another two battleships. And that is a completed fleet. And sure, we'll have some star charts from you lads. Why not? A lot happening in the galaxy here. But we will get rid of these pirates. You mark my words, my friends. Oh, losing money again. That's going to be a worry. Oh, God, and we've got to upgrade these as well. Um, okay. So with the upgrade, I think this fleet's going to be ready, as a matter of fact. Uh, let's first of all... That ship upkeep, minus 10%. Yeah, that, that was the kind of money that we needed. But we need to look at money again, as a matter of fact. Uh, service there. Oh, wow, we're, gro we're growing quick here, lads. Nicely done. Okay, let's get someone over there. I quite like Jean stuff there. Actually, no, I wouldn't. No, I wouldn't, because it might upset the animals. Wait, oh, no, I've just built it in the wrong place. Oh, well, what's done is done now. Science is more important. Right, so let's go power plant. In all the blank tiles here, I think we'll put a power plant and one gene volts at some point. But that will do us for there. Um, oh, look at that. We're back up to 30-something. 11.4k now, so we just need one more ship. One more ship, and we'll build it here. And it will be an artillery one. And then our fleet is ready. But we still have enough for a little fleet. Maybe just a little supporting fleet or something there. Right, ship upgrade cost, core sector systems, that's what we need. And physics lab would be good. High plane mapping would be good, but we don't really need to know about it. That's what we want. Power plant three. Many of the Sergog inhabitants in Oskek have turned into genetic modification to help them cope with the planet's hostile environment. Hey man, good stuff. The changes have made themselves are being passed on to their offspring and their physical appearance is changing at an alarming rate. They are calling themselves the Neo-Sergog. What on earth do you look like, the neo Sergog? Oh, you still look the same, silly billies. Hey, it was an experiment that we knew we were undertaking, right? I don't feel bad about it. Right. This is looking very good. Let's just have a look at one of our battleships here. Large antimatter missiles. We just need these to be upgraded, really. Let's just have a look at our ship designer again, because I don't entirely trust the... I mean, we could have a better one of them now, couldn't we? And a better one of them. What's going on here? Oh, we auto upgrade quantum missile. Hang on a minute. The auto upgrades aren't working. Right. Let's start from the top. From our Corvettes here. Right. We have the right things here, I think. We have the best things here. I think we have the zero point power. We have that. Okay, so they upgraded. Yeah, that's done fine. Good job there. Um, our destroyers seem to have done the trick as well good job there yeah that all looks in order that all looks in order that's a quantum missile isn't it yep good and that's as it as it should be okay our cruisers they're quantum missiles and uh yeah that that's all looking good as well so what are our battleships doing lads what are our battleships doing oh wait that one has worked did i just look at the wrong one quantum missiles quantum missiles ah oh, this one wasn't auto upgrading that's what had happened. Okay, luckily there wasn't a hell of a lot to do manually with it. But we've got all of these to upgrade now. A lot of excess power they're getting, so maybe some better defence would be an idea. But there we go. That's that done. And then there'll be another upgrade to be done here. Research is complete, you say? UV laser, that's what we're looking for. And only 11 months to get it. That's pretty good. So, as we said, we were looking for 12k, weren't we? Abyssal Flotilla is upgrading there, so we'll just give it another, I think, a G-Class battleship. We'll do. And then we're looking pretty good on the whole for this pirate invasion. But what we're going to want to do now, and um, we'll do it in the capital, Wanjog. Let's do, do, let's make another fleet. Should we just do a pure battleship fleet? That one's a bit of a mix. A pure battleship fleet. Oh, we've only got room for another 16 vessels. Oh, sorry, 14 vessels. So maybe a couple of destroyers just for a support. 
would be a good idea. Or maybe what we should do is just fill in this with as much room as we have left because we can only afford one more battleship and then we'd be left with six. So that's a cruiser, isn't it? A cruiser and a destroyer. So you know what? Let's just do six corvettes if we can. And we'll upgrade it a little bit. Or upgrade the speed a little bit. So six corvettes and another battleship. And then that's our fleet. And it's going to be a bit stronger than I intended, but we can't have two good fleets. We might as well have one good fleet for now. And then when our naval capacity goes up a lot more, then would be the time to, you know. It's always nice to have a couple more corvettes in the in the business, isn't it? So this flotilla right now, what are we looking at? We're looking at a hell of a lot of ships, aren't we? So many that the game froze when I clicked on it. Right now... Oh, we can't even tell from there. Let's, let's go into the system and look at it. It's a bit big, isn't it? It's a bit big. What, we got eight cruisers, 12... Or, sorry, eight battleships, 12 cruisers, 34 destroyers and 10 corvettes. We've got some more corvettes coming in. It's a lot of destroyers. Okay. So we're going to save up for another... I'd like to go for another artillery class, I think. It's a little bit cheaper, actually. Oh, no, that's a gunship. Yeah, artillery class is a little bit more expensive, but that's okay. And then we're going to have room just to chuck a couple more little cutie corvettes in. And they'll all have their UV, or their UV lasers soon. Construction is getting completed all over the place. Is very much among the type of thing that I like to hear. Construction complete. In fact, we've only got enough for another, another two corvettes there. That's all we can do. I forgot we had another one build, being built in Osek. So we are going to need to think about armies soon, but let's not worry about it just yet. So we'll wait four months, and then our UV lasers can come in. We'll upgrade the fleet, and then I know we need 18k, and we're going to be on about 14k. Oh no, who died there? Who died there? A governor of Ogo again, was it? No, it just always sends us to Ogo, I guess. Who was it? It was Overseer. That's not a scientist then, is it? Okay, well, first one to get clicked on gets a, gets an overseer for the day. Was it no one? Have we lost a scientist? Have we lost an, a, a general? System survey. Oh, we did lose a scientist. Oh, bother. Right. Um, research speed 5%. Completely lies found that will do us. That's a good one. And they will auto-explore. We're losing a bit of money again. That's really not that good, is it? Um... Stuff's coming in there. We have a lot of power plants to upgrade, I've just realised. That makes me a bit pleased, lads, would you know. Many building upgrades to be done right now, and uh, we'll go for society there, and society there. We're leaving engineering behind a little bit, but, it, you know, if the tech's giving me it, then I'm going to take it. Right, when these constructions come in, we're going to be making a obscene amount of money, and it's extremely pleasing. Something to be built there. Right, do we have gene vats on this planet? We do not. Let's get them. Where are they? Oh, where, where are they? I don't see them anywhere. Oh, maybe we do have gene vats. I'm not seeing gene vats. Hmm. System survey. Well, we'll go for a power plant then. Why not? Okay, oh no, did someone else die? Surlus has died. Who was Surlus? Was he a scientist? No, but we do have a science coming in. Very happy to see that adaptable come in for us. And we'll go for the extra physics lab. That guy just died. Um, that's no good. Died right as we were looking at him. Research speed is a nice one to get there, though. Um, our other scientist, maybe? Maybe it was one of our governors? Uh, he's still kicking. 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 Oh, I guess it was that scientist then. Right, researches are getting completed, aren't they? Trait points. Ooh. Ooh, yes, I think so. Wow, let's have a look at this, actually, because we... Don't we get another trait, actually? I don't know. Oh, no, the traits are just for the rulers. I was thinking about the ethics and the civics there. But it's all good. Right, now, this fleet is what we want to be caring about right now. 13.5k, and they're upgrading to UV lasers now, which hopefully won't take too long. That should put them at 14k. These buildings should come in, and that will rectify this silly thing that's happening. 
and we're going to go and destroy us some pirates. They have plagued us for long enough here. We will have our vengeance. Oh, good. The Bintu says, don't even know where our science ships are now. Right, what are we looking at here? 14k. System survey. Let's get them over there. This could be a bit messy, you know. We're minus 34 now. Hmm, why are we sending minus 34? Not entirely sure why we're suddenly minus 34 from minus 6. Soon enough, though, we'll be able to... I'm not sure how much that's going to help us by, but I would have thought quite a lot. Right, let's watch this unfold. Big fighting here. Although we should definitely have the better of this fleet. We have a very skilled general with us. UV lasers and the blue lasers are going off. Why am I seeing blue lasers, though? Who's still got blue lasers? Um, not sure. Oh, well, we'll worry about it after the fight. We're certainly knocking them back a bit, though, aren't we? Here we go. 7.4, now with 13. Oh, God, maybe it's worth us actually just building a couple of ships to support after this. You know what? Let's do that. Let's get another G-Class battleship, and let's get another, another G-Class battleship in a minute, and they can come and reinforce. One hell of a fight. I'm seeing blue lasers, though. We're all seeing these blue lasers on the destroyer, is that? Looks like a destroyer. Why am I seeing blue lasers on my destroyer then, eh? Riddle me that. Because we're all still using blue bloody lasers. Because someone isn't auto-upgrading. Why? For goodness sake. Right. I want to see purple lasers everywhere else. And it looks like I am. Crew, yeah, that's all in order. That's all in order. That's all in order. It was just that one for some reason. Wasn't playing ball. Well, now we're playing ball. And if any of them survive, and they probably will because... Majority of our... Oh, all of our Corvettes are dead already. Not really much point in Corvettes now, I'm discovering. Anyway, we'll go for another A-Class in a second. When we can. This fight's been won, though. This fight's been won quite well. We've certainly done some good work. Oh, dear. Okay, now the... Uh, now the big station itself is coming in. A lot of missiles going towards it. A lot of missiles going towards it. Oh, crikey. Come on, lads. We can do it. See, I mean, I guess you want Corvettes. Oh, who else is firing blue lasers? Who's this? That's a Ganfus. Why am I seeing blue lasers on my Ganfuses, eh? They're my battleships. Shouldn't be. Oh, well. They'll all have a repair and an upgrade in a minute. But we really do need to get more, more people in the fight right now, don't we? So let's actually send some cruisers down if we can. We'll send a G-Class cruiser in a second when we can afford to do it. It's going to be a little while until we can afford to do it, though. Actually, we've taken no damage at all from this. Oh, get wrecked, Mr. Pirate Man. Oh, that's more like it. Blooming excellent. Look at that. Look at that. And there it goes. The Pirate Menace has been dealt with. Oh, beautiful. Alright, so our fleet capacity has been somewhat less lessened there, but I think repairing that is going to be very good. Many techs came in. Well, actually, one tech came in in that excitement there. Maybe some armor would do us would do us some favors. Right, we need a science ship over here, researching special projects in this system and surveying it. And he's a bit of a distance, but that's okay. That was a bit exciting, wasn't it? Why do we have untapped resources over here then someone riddle me that please okay we are going to have to rebuild that fleet somewhat but i think there's going to be something good in this system i think there's going to be something very good and you know what we might as well do now get a colony ship up and get this place look there yeah, yeah definitely 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 want to bring into the fold there okay we can put it back up to fastest now i guess well, that was a bit exciting. We'll discover what wonders lay within it next time. Thank you so much for watching, my friends. I played for a lot there. I, I just went from episode four to whatever episode this is in one sitting. Thanks for watching, my friends. I'll see you later.